Kenyon Martin Jr. is the favorite. And it doesn't matter how many times I see this name. It will never not make me feel old. Yep. Like, yep. I'm, yep. Like, I'm like, I'm, I'm watching his son right now. Um, had, had one of those moments with uh, – with LeBron, with LeBron and uh, Jabari Smith Jr., where he was like, "Hey, yeah, you played against my dad," and LeBron was like, "Oh God, I need to retire. Like, <laughs> I'm, I'm getting too old. I'm getting too old for this." Um, but as of right now, Kenyon Martin Jr. leading the pack. You can see there's really not a, a wide range here. Mac McClung uh, in on second. Not a huge uh, contest in terms of name recognition. Let's get one thing clear: Shaden Sharp would have ran away with this if he participated. I feel robbed that he's not going to be in it. Um, it's it would have been nice. It, yeah. it, like he he's had some really good in-game dunks this year. Obviously, I mean, look, I'm happy for Jericho Sims. Obviously, he gets a chance to do this. Uh, he's been a, a nice little uh, surprise after being drafted 58 this year. That said, I, I mean, I would love to um, boast about you know good value play. Big guys don't win this thing. I mean, you know, with the exception of Dwight, who brought, uh, shall we say, a, a very unique energy to uh, mm. the dunk contest when he took home the prize. I mean, you had your Blake Griffin. You did have Obi, Obi Toppin last year. And the Knicks, we should say, have had a good history with this. Nate Robinson, Obi, um, you know, Dennis Smith Jr. had a nice showing a couple years ago. He had some old school guys if you really want to go back. But, yeah, I don't, I don't know if this is going to be Sims' one to win. I mean, to me, I, I know you say no name recognition, but you said it makes you feel old for a reason. It's because his dad, I mean, the lineage is there. I, to me, you're getting good enough value on the favorite. I, I'd go with, you know, Kevin Martin Jr. here. I, th this is a no brainer to me. I'm going Mac McClung. Yeah. Like this is, oh, this really? is someone, okay. this, this is someone that I have followed since I was in high school. Like this guy is capable of pulling off any dunk, honestly. Um, and I, you know, it, it also helps that there's not that much name recognition too, because, you know, as you get older in All-Star Weekend, you start you stop participating. It doesn't mean as much. You don't want to get hurt, things like that. We have a lot of young guys, which is really good. They want to make a name for themselves. Um, I mean, think about Zach Levine and Aaron Gordon. Like, everyone knew who they were, but this is – that is a huge mark uh, on their legacy. Mac McClung is capable of pulling off any dunk. I think he is going to do something absolutely crazy. My only concern is that he tries to get a little too crazy, honestly, and he, like, can't pull off a dunk. Uh, but I – if you haven't watched his dunks, take 15 minutes off from work today. Watch his dunks. Your, your jaw is going to be on the ground. Like, it is some of the craziest stuff you'll see. Yeah, I mean, I like Mac McClung. Um, I hope he pulls something off. I, just as someone who uh, probably around the same age as you, I remember when this event mattered. Um, mm. And it feels like it's been a while. So to have a, a little bit of a rebirth, I don't care who it comes from, I'd, I'd sign up for an RP.